Hi friends, I'm Mitch and this is my review of the Coral Angel 5 Pencil Sharpener. So this is a hand cranked sharpener that I use for pastel pencils. So before I got this I was using the other type of sharpeners like this one and this one and a bunch of other different pastel sharpeners for pencils and the issue I had was the blades are sharp and they're thin and they would dull out. So after seven, eight, nine pencil sharpens, um, they would dull out. In addition, they would produce this weird pointy tip that I didn't like. So what I did was ended up getting this Coral Angel 5. I did buy a few blades to replace these with, but as you can see, I went through all the blades. I'm down to like the last one or two. So that's a problem with these. It needs a lot of upkeep. So the Coral Angel 5 comes with a reservoir for your shavings, your pastel dust, etc. And that thing slides out so that you can dump your reservoir and reset it. And in addition, it's obviously hand cranked. You jam your pencils into there and sharpen them. So what I've done is this thing comes apart easily, which is good because the mechanism in it, as you can see, it's not a fine little blade. Instead, it's a thick honk of metal that's sort of sharpened at the end. However, you'll see, you know, where some of the shavings get caught up in it. That will happen when you sharpen with pastel pencils. Let's put this back together if I can. It's kind of a pain. Okay, I'll put this back together. So we have a carbothetyl pencil. Let's jam it in here and it pulls out. You squeeze it pulls out, you squeeze this and then let go and we'll grab your pencil. You squeeze, let go, and that forces your pencil in inside. So let's sharpen a pastel pencil. Okay, and then after it's sharpened, you get this nice pointy tip. Nice tip just like you like it, ready to do some pastel drawings. Now we'll do a couple of these and I'll show you how it gets clogged up. Get a nice pointy tip. Do one more. So it does a nice job sharpening pastel pencils. However, once you're done sharpening, if you break it open, you will notice that it gets really, really clogged. So that metal piece gets clogged with pastels. So you can kind of see that. The metal hunk gets clogged with pastel dust. And you do five, six, seven pastel pencils, and it will be completely clogged and it will not work anymore. So the solution is to jam a regular pencil through here. So I have a few regular pencils. Now, what I would recommend you do is to buy, they have a 144 pencil set on Amazon for $14. I'd buy that, unless you have a lot of other pencils you wanna sharpen. And what you can do is just go through that pencil set on Amazon, get one of those, and just sharpen random pencils and what that does is it will clean out your pencil sharpener of all that extra dust. So these are regular pencils I'm jamming through here. And the regular pencils will, will clean it for you instead of you having to do it. That's not very sharp. And a couple more regular pencils. Alright, so after you do a few regular pencils, let's open it back up and take a look at it. And you can see that all the pastel dust is now cleaned out. So the regular pencils, what it did was it knocked out all that pastel dust and cleaned it out for you instead of you having to open this and clean it every time. I'm not sure if this piece in here is stainless. I guess worst case you could break it open, 
and wash it every few, but again, I don't know if it's stainless or not. The easier solution, instead of just breaking it open, is after three, four pastel pencils, get one regular pencil, jam it in there, sharpen it about halfway, and it'll clean your mechanism for you. And it seems to be a good way to just reset this thing. But for pastel pencils, I've tried several different brands, and it works good. These are carbothetal pencils, and it worked really well, and overall I'm pleased with this sharpener. And I think I definitely want to keep this. Uh, it does grind down your pencils a little more than other things, but considering these are only a dollar each, and I don't use a lot of pastel pencils, then I think that um, that's going to be good for me. So, again, this is the Coral Angel 5. It's available under a variety of other names as well. But it's a really good sharpener, and I like it a lot. I especially like that its opening is wide enough for some of the bigger pencils. So if you get some of the big, big Derwent pencils, it will fit those. So it's oversized. So overall, I like it. That is the Angel 5.